Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm really sorry that I haven't uploaded anything in a while. That's because uh, I wasn't keeping well. I had a really bad throat infection. Kaya wasn't well too. And everyone in the house was not keeping well. So, you know, the usual weather changing um, viral and everything. So, we hopefully have um, recovered. Uh, anyway, so... Um, since Christmas is around the corner and the festivity already seems in the air so I thought what would be a better idea than to make a roast chicken dinner recipe sounds scary not at all I have the most easy peasy chicken roast recipe so let's begin so there are few key things you need to do to make a juicy and delicious chicken every single time so tip number one so before you roast your whole chicken you need to marinate the chicken overnight. Tip number two, the most important thing is please do not do anything much to the chicken. I know it may not sound tempting to your tongues but you know doing too much to your chicken is just going to take away the real flavor of the roast chicken. Tip number three, do not uh, open the oven door to check on your chicken while it's still cooking. You know, taking the chicken in and out of the open oven, uh, making the temperature go up and down is just going to make a very uneven cooking which is going to ruin the recipe. Tip number four, please make sure your chicken is fresh which is obviously basic but is also really important. It will make a huge difference, trust me. So I think now enough of my blabbering, so let's get started with marinating the chicken. First thing we need to do is take out the whole chicken out of our fridge and wash it inside out. Mix salt, pepper and a juice of one lemon. Rub it nicely on your whole chicken. Make sure you part the skin off the chicken and rub the marination inside the skin as well. Then sprinkle parsley and chili flakes on the chicken and add a dash of olive oil as a coating to it. So now you are ready to refrigerate the chicken for overnight. Take the chicken out of our fridge and prepare for greasing it. So for uh, greasing you would need salted butter, pepper, paprika and parsley. Mix all the ingredients together. Now take the paste and start greasing the chicken with it and let it infuse all the mixture while we get the stuffing ready. So we will take chopped onions, ginger garlic paste chopped tomatoes, mushrooms and capsicum. Put some oil into your pan and add the chopped onions. Fry the onions till it's golden brown. Now add the ginger garlic paste and further fry it. Then add the tomatoes and the chopped capsicum and mushroom and a dash of salt, pepper and garam masala. Fry till everything is well cooked. Now, while we wait for the stuffing to cool down, let's get our sides ready. Our first side is a salad. For the salad, you would need Mix well the chopped cabbage, cucumber, tomato and salt and pepper and lemon juice to it. Garnish with chopped coriander and your salad is ready.
Now let's get our next side ready. So our next side is an egg fried rice. For the egg fried rice you will need In a pan, use 1 tablespoon oil and scramble the eggs by adding some salt and pepper to it. Then keep it aside for mixing later. Now, take 2 tablespoon oil into the pan and fry the chopped onions and garlic till it turns golden brown. Add the cooked rice, scrambled eggs and mix and fry well. Now garnished with chopped coriander and your egg fried rice is ready. Now let's get back to the chicken. Next step is to fill the chicken with the stuffing and stitch it well. You will need a large needle and the thick thread to stitch the chicken. You will need to stitch the opening towards the neck of the chicken so that we could uh, use the bottom for stuffing the chicken. Now stuff the chicken from the bottom with the stuffing we had prepared earlier. Take a longer thread and stitch the bottom to tying the legs and wings of the chicken together. Somewhat like this. Now. Insert your rotisserie to go all the way through the chicken. Make sure the attachment holds the chicken together. Next step is to roast the chicken in the oven. Fix the rotisserie in place and let it roast in the oven at 250 degree for about 60 minutes. Please do not open the oven in between like I told you earlier. You can check the color of the chicken from outside to make sure it's cooked. And there you have a finely roasted chicken with salad and right side. Hope you'll try this recipe. If you liked it, please comment and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye.